very four very well struck penalty shootouts by Orlando so this could be it if Castellano misses ladies and gents this will be over if Castellano misses it will be the first win in a playoff game in the history of Orlando Castellanos the 22 year old strike at him in the side by Galassa this one's over Orlando City has won this one and look at Oscar Pareja's reaction headed to the tunnel it's over folks Orlando City wait a minute wait a minute Alex Berry what I is going thought, on I thought I heard the whistle from Alan Chapman I did too are they gonna do a repeat of this let's see if Pedro Galese you need to have a foot on the line. And he didn't. I want to take another look. I think he jumped look. it. Wow. Oh, that is a brave, brave call by the referee. It's going to well, be talked about. And now he may have a dialogue here with Guido Gonzalez Jr. and company. Somebody go get Oscar Pareja. Tell him it's <laughs> not over. He's already celebrating the victory. I think Chapman. Oh, what a decision! Okay, so here. this is this is the shot we want to see. I mean, I get that rules are rules, but this happens maybe in every single penalty kick taken. And a, yeah, oh, a red card! What? Wow! Unbelievable! I can't believe it! Alejandro Berry, no puedo creer lo que acabo de ver. This is unbelievable. So not only does Galese leave now, and I'm speechless. Alex, now he misses the next game if Orlando goes through. And correct me if I'm wrong, but Schlegel's going to put on. It looked like. No, no, no. I mean, this, this is just unbelievable. We've never seen something, anything like this before. That's what Rona. a turn of events. That, that's that's Rona and, and Oscar <laughs> and Pareja. Pareja. Doesn't know what's going on. Probably has no idea that Galese has been sent off. Now, my question is this, why was Galese shown a second yellow card? Was it because he said something to a referee? Or, I, or I was believe it you're shown the yellow when you when you jump on a penalty kick, and that is the rule. Well, that's my question. If that was the case, because he jumped before the ball was struck, or because he said something to the referee after the call was made. But in any case, Galese has been shown a red card in an unexpected turn of events and you know whatever hap whatever is happening if you're Orlando you need to focus because you still have the advantage in the series maybe you won't have your best player who is your goalkeeper for the next round but you need to finish this off whatever happens you're still one penalty away from making it through Oh, wow. This is unbelievable stuff. I mean... If, if I told you about this Alex Berry pregame and I scripted a perfect story for you and I told you what would happen, you would probably think I'm absolutely crazy. It's now 3.10 Eastern Time. We've had 10 minutes of stoppage in the second half. We've had the extra time. We've had Galese sent off in a penalty kick shootout. Alex Berry, do you remember ever seeing a goalkeeper being sent off in a penalty kick shootout? Not booked, being sent off. Well, I, I don't, and not only that, after making the game-winning save, I'm not sure about that second yellow card. If it's automatic or not. 
But apparently, because he jumped the line, he got booked for a second time, and he's gone. Rowe has to come on now. And listen, you're absolutely right. Orlando City does have the edge, but Rowe comes in cold into a penalty kick shootout. He never thought he'd be a part of, but he could become a hero here very yeah. quickly. I mean, a lot is going to be talked about. Uh, I'll let you with the call, but honestly, it's a controversial uh, decision by the referee. I mean, the, the sending off Galese, I, I, I just don't agree with it. I mean, if you want to repeat the penalty, fine, but showing him a red card for that, unless he said something directly to the referee. Otherwise, I don't understand it. Valentin Castellanos 2.0. to keep his team alive and bury this in the back of the net. If he misses, this one is over as it appeared to be minute to go right before one of the craziest events I've ever seen in a penalty kick shootout. Wait a minute. Are they now talking to Alan Chapman about something else? Now, what is going on? I mean, the referees are just losing control of the situation. The and this is completely icing. The red card shouldn't have been shown to Galese. And now it seems like maybe they're going to take it back. No, I don't know. no, 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 no. I don't believe this. I don't believe this. Or, or maybe they weren't allowed to make that substitution. Yes. Th th this is what I was telling you, yeah, Alex. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you're not allowed to make a substitution once the game is over and once you're in the penalty and, shootout. And that but is... Why would they allow it in the first place? And that is why Rodrigo Schlegel... Was going to put the gloves on. Was going to put the gloves... This is unbelievable. But, I mean, referees need to be control, in control of the situation. And clearly, they've lost control. And there's obviously a lot of confusion. Alex Berry. <laughs> but Please tell me what's going on here. I mean, the referees have made a disaster out of this situation. And they're to blame for. Because, first of all, it doesn't make sense to me for Galese to be sent off. That's the first one. And, and then to allow the substitution and then go back on it and say... You're not allowed to come in. So they reverse a decision that they already made. I mean, this is just the worst VAR moment we've seen so far this season. Unbelievable. And again, if you're Orlando, if you're Oscar Pareja, despite everything that's going on, focus. You have the advantage. Oh. You have what it takes to make it through. All these distractions need to be put away to finish this one off. But it's just unbelievable. I mean, I've never seen anything like this before. The referees are so uh, uh, laughing stock. A lot of and people. They need, they need to get their act together. So now, apparently, no, no. I mean, so apparently now he says. You can come in, and, 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 and now again, he reverses it for a second time. What is going on? And by the way, Columbus New York Red Bulls will have to start. You have it on the lower left side of your monitor, TV screen, whatever you're enjoying on. Alex Berry and Ramza Sandoval, yours truly, will be on the call of that one as well. This is absolutely nuts. Now, a lot of people, Alex, getting in touch with us via social media says, when there's an infraction from the goalkeeper on a penalty kick shootout, it doesn't matter if he's booked. The first has to be a verbal warning. There was no verbal warning for Galese. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And I mean, so, for, and, and, and you know what, Alex? Alan Chapman could have avoided all of this with that verbal warning. So yeah. Schlegel is going to come in to be the goalkeeper here. This is a joke. A joke. And it's terribly handled by the referees who are to blame of this situation.
and and uh, it, it's gonna end up after all this mess being Schlegel who puts the gloves on and and they still have the possibility of, of making it through they have the advantage they're one penalty away either either they save it here or they make the next one and they go through here's Valentin Castellano Schlegel to be a hero here if he saves this here's a shot and it's in the back of the net from Castellanos and so with everything going around the bottom line is Galese shouldn't have been sent off and Orlando is not allowed to make a substitution yeah in a penalty kick shootout it's a field the, player that, that needs to that, take the that spot I understand but what I don't is referees allowing it in the first place and then going back on a decision they've made they need to be on top of the situation they need to know the, the, the right. rules I mean they need to be in control and they lost it completely you know what and now need to strike this and put it in the in the back of the net and 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 with that ladies and gentlemen not need to strike this and bury it and put Orlando in the next round however they would be without Galese not need to put this in the back for Orlando Nani saved by Sean Johnson wow and this is absolutely unbelievable because now Schlegel will have to stay on as your goalkeeper Alex Berry I am looking at you and you can't believe this yeah I mean this is what you wanted to avoid because after after all the the, the mess and the distractions you needed to 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 be able to focus and just finish it off and Nani needed to make sure that ball went in Whatever is going yeah, around, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's on to, Nani. Yeah, you need to put that ball in. I agree with you, Alex. Here's Acevedo! Buries it. And, and, and now, obviously, momentum is going in a different direction. They're, st they're still in it. So. By the way, the Columbus crew and the New York Red Bull are off. In map fray, we will be sent into that soon enough. This I, is unbelievable stuff. I cannot believe my eyes. No, what, what, what is going on here? This this is this is potential for a dangerous ending, hopefully not, if Sean Johnson keeps this out. They're out exploring. Here's a shot, it's in the back of the net. That's well done by Robin Johnson. Of course now, in sudden death here, penalty kick. Wise. Johnson going the other way on this one. Yeah, they're still alive, they're still kicking, they're still in the fight. But what a mess. And I mean, unless the yellow card was shown because of Galese saying something to the referee, but that would have been a straight red, not a second yellow. No. So I don't understand really that decision. Oranenson to strike now. Schlegel's in the back. The shot, Schlegel saves it! Can you believe that? Unbelievable stuff here! Unbelievable stuff here, ladies and gentlemen. Wait, 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 wait a moment. I'm afraid to call anything any longer here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm with you. It, apparently, it it's over. It's over. It's over. Orlando goes through. Wow. What a finish, ladies and gentlemen. Orlando City has won their first playoff game in history. And they've done it in their first playoff game in history. One for one, Schlegel here, saving the shot from Theronidson. His right boot never left that goal line. What a finish from Exploria Stadium. Orlando City moves on. It has been the craziest ending to a match that I have witnessed. Orlando, deservingly so, goes through despite the mess made by the referees who are still talking amongst themselves to try and figure out what went on although 
I'm afraid for any decision to be called back because we've seen it before. But it has been just a nightmare. situation for Orlando what is going on I mean, Alex please speak it's, it's, to it's, me it's, it's getting to, to, to a point where, where where it's ridiculous right this is getting kind of ridiculous so Here's the strike, and now, now it's, over. it's official.